What's going on guys? Back at it with another Fallout 76 video. So in this one we're going to be going over to uh, the Wavy Willards. Is it in the Wavy Willards? You know what? I think it might be in the Wavy Willards so that we can make a contact contact with Miss Annie. Uh, if I remember correctly, this one also gives you a unique weapon as well along with it. So I'm pretty excited to get this one. It's not a bad uh mission whatsoever it's just like the thing about it is there's a lot of going back and forth and fast traveling with this mission so it's kind of like uh it's kind of like weird it makes you go to a lot of different locations it's like a like a detective work almost uh but on top of that i don't think this is going to be a full hour video if it's just with that so if that's the case we might do another mission along with it this one i want to save it for its own video uh, so I might connect that with something else. So uh, we might actually do that one and then investigate Harper's Ferry because there is something there along with it. But who knows? We'll see when that time comes. But for now, I kind of want to make a quick pit stop before we go over there because I do want to get a new hat uh, to go along with this outfit. So let's get to it. All right. So first things first, I kind of want to make my way over to Fallout or to uh, Vault 76 because there's a, a hat that I think would look good with this outfit. Almost like if you were a drill sergeant, you wear those drill sergeant hats. Um, I don't know. It's just very remin reminiscent of when I was in the army. So it's kind of like I kind of want to do it. You know what I mean? So And it's kind of on the way. So it'll save me a little bit of caps in the long run. But if I remember correctly, it's over here by this like truck. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and kill all these little lonely liberators in the process. Hello. Goodbye. It should be right here next to this truck. Oh, you want to juke me, boy? Who do you think you is? It's right here. Campaign hat. All right, let's go ahead and put this on. Oh, about to say, didn't I just put it on? And now I look like a drill sergeant. All right, so now let's go ahead and fast travel way up north to Wavy Willard's, right? Contact Miss Annie. Yep, there we go. All right, let's go. Cool. Wavy Willard's is such a cool spot, man. Like, I don't know. I kind of wish there was more to do there because, like, once you do this mission, it's kind of like there really isn't much to do there anymore at that point. You know what I mean? I don't know. I wish a lot of places in the Appalachia was like that like I know the Capitol building like you see right here in this still uh, frame that there's a lot of things to do there like you have to go back there multiple times throughout the quest lines and stuff but I mean that's only like one ex one uh, situation but all right we're here in wavy Willards so let's take out some scores shall we Goodbye. Get out of here, you petrified corpse. Alright. There's gonna be a few of them up here. Mic off. Whoop. Together. Definitely gotta eh, I might just leave it there. My headset likes to do that sometimes. Sorry for the noise for the mic off. Get out of here. What are you doing? Leave me alone. You guys are rude. Always getting all up in my face. And always end up losing. Hello. Kill. Kill. All. Kill? What? How did you not die? Oh, dude, I was playing my main character earlier today. And I just saw that Scorch right there said that he had a buoy knife. Well, I had a pretty sick freaking uh, uh, anti-armor uh, swing speed buoy knife that spawned on a robot but once i killed him he blew up really fast as soon as i got to him basically and i died and once i died or whatever the freaking robot disappeared and i wasn't even able to loot the the the, the whatever it's called the weapon User, uh, i would have gave it to him to find Freddy? yep his father he put a tracker on Freddy that the lovely boy could not remove but on that terrible day, it stopped. The policemen, they tried. 
It was simple. Clues were found here. All of this, my Freddy. He was not found. He could live, no? No. You Maybe. So he could. Such a clever boy. Now, maybe a man. Such a long time to wait for word of mon petit chou. But Nanny, she cannot bypass privacy protocol. To enter the security office is unauthorized. Maybe you can enter? Sure, why not? So access security system, is that here Wavy Willards? It is, as a matter of fact. And we actually passed right by there, so most of the uh, Scorched should already be taken care of, so... Who knows? Maybe I'm wrong. And I am. <laughs> Alrighty. So there goes another one dead. Another one bites dust. That is so random. Why is there a... A Mr. Gutsy here? So, okay, the first time I came here, I had to... I picked... I literally came and picked locked this when all you had to do is come around to be able to come in. All right, let me take care of these guys first before they bother me while I'm trying to hack a computer. All right, we should be good. All right. Access the security system. All right, this is a private system that belongs to the Wavy Willard's Water Park. Access is restricted to specific employees. Unauthorized use of... Uh, unauthorized use is prohibited by law. Let's go ahead and read this. So, extended hours. For all the time in our park's history, we will be extending our our hours into October. The weather has been so mild this year that we have uh, have an opportunity to welcome more visitors before our winter shutdown and maintenance. During October, we plan to open Monday through Friday. Okay, those are just the hours. Uh, we will close as needed uh, should the weather turn unpleasant management. October birthdays. The following birthday parties will be hosted in the sp Splish Splash area for the month of October. October 2nd, Johnson family and uh, friends celebrating the 8th birthday of Stacy Johnson. October 13th, uh, Williams and Lewin family celebrating the 3rd birthday of Blanche Williams. October 17th, Davies family and friends celebrating the 7th birthday of Nate Davis Davies all available staff members will be gathered to sing happy birthday to the kids management all right so arrivals staff members will no longer be permitted on the premises more than an hour prior to the scheduled shift and they must depart the premises within an hour after the end of their workday unfortunately this policy had to be uh, put in place because some employees were loitering after work or arriving early to enjoy rides without paying even a discounted staff uh, admission fee. This behavior is selfish and will not be tolerated. Management. Hollow tape reviews. All employees who are assisting in the review should report to the underground section of the staff area where the past month's hollow tapes are stored checking with the security supervisor on duty there uh on duty there so the time is recorded correctly your help is greatly appreciated management okay nothing there alerts wait a minute we saw operations right okay hollow tape reviews okay so this is a separate one called the same thing so alerts uh, counterfeit bills. In the month of September, a total of five counterfeit bills were passed uh, to unwary staff members with a total loss amounting to $47. This was our worst, mo worst month in the history of the park. Uh, security staff will conduct training immediately to help employees identify these fakes. It is in your best interest to pay attention as any further losses due to your in, uh, inattention will be taken out of your pay. So, 
Adjusted for fallout inflation, $47 realistically is literally a few cents. <laughs> and that's their worst in history, right? All right, notice to all employees. In the early mornings, in the early morning hours on October 15th, a section of our park fence was scaled by an intruder. This individual attempted to break into the storerooms in the underground employee restricting area, uh, restricted area, but was disturbed uh, in the act of prying the door open by our alert watchman. This criminal ran off and managed to escape uh, his just punishment. This doesn't seem to be uh, the local kids because commie propaganda, uh, propaganda denouncing the war efforts just dropped as the intruder fled. The police have been notified to the possibility of a pilot, of a plot, and are on the lookout. If you have any information to provide contact management immediately. Whoa, that just got interesting. Kidnapping. Notice to all employees. Warm. Again. Oh god, I gotta read this fast because we got Scorch right behind us. Notice to all employees, everyone has heard about the missing child, Freddy, who may have been kidnapped from our very own water park. As part of some anti-war protest, management and our security staff are working closely uh, with the Grafton police to find the child. Any employee that is able to come in to help review security holotapes will be paid overtime for the hours they spread. Man, it sounds like Wavy Willers have been getting into some stuff, huh? All right, holotape reviews, 10. Uh, night shift notes, uh, 12 hours of kids squealing at the pool, got nothing. 19. Looked at Slither Slide and Kitty Slide for 12 hours. <laughs> Found a tape that is Probably the kid getting nabbed at the slit. Whoa, okay. So we should probably stop there and get this. Uh, I think the kid knew the guy. Uh-oh. Put it in the sec office safe till the feds or whoever can get it. Pete. Okay. Eight hours and nothing. Cover the fountain, Bob. 21st. Review 10 hours of bathroom footage. Dear God, some people. No sign of the kid. Tom. This is getting tiring. Six hours of gator mouth and another four hours of panicked uh, picnic tables up top. No luck. Pete. Uh, were we on 21 or 22? Okay, we were on 22, so 23rd now. Three hours of concessions. Got a guy acting real weird about a about a package. Might be the same guy that that slide uh, slide tape. Setting it aside. I'll get it to the office and shift. Tom. All right. So play hollow tape clues. One is literally just right here. Okay. And luckily we can pick lock this safe. Oh, close. Oh, wrong way. Bingo. All right, so let's go ahead and take hey that. Hey there, Freddy. <laughs> hey, wh where's your nanny? You know what? I have a surprise for you. I don't want the other kids to see them. They might get a challenge. <gasps> what is... This is the no. of Eastern Regional Penitentiary. Our okay, we got, we're going to have to play that again. Woefully short. Obviously, there's been a mass breakout. I'm authorizing prison marshals to seek out escape prisoners. Due to overcrowding and the logistics of caring for live prisoners, immediate use of lethal force is authorized. Hmm. There seems to be an issue with the marshal's visual recognition system. No time to fix it now. I must stop those escapees. Okay. Well, that gave us a new quest, but we're in for hey this there, one, so let's Freddy. listen to this. <laughs> hey, what? Where's your nanny? You know what? I have a surprise for you. I don't want the other kids to see, though. They might get jealous. <gasps> what is it? What's my surprise? I want to see it. Please. Please. Where is it? I don't think a nanny will like it. Let's take off your ID there so 
know she can't find you. And then I can take you to the surprise. Oh, what's that sound, boys and girls? Slither slide! Swoosh! Splash! <laughs> Man, little Freddy really did know this guy. All right, let's listen to the second one. Hello, sir. Welcome to Wavy Willard's Water Park. How can I help? Uh, howdy. Was wondering where that box is for the mail. The one that puts a special stamp on the ladder. Oh, uh, you can find it over by the Crocolossus Mountain entrance. Right over that way. Okay. Um. Well, there's some... Okay, so we gotta go in this direction, it looks like. Oh, so the first one is actually right here. We were already next to it, so we got a P.O. Box number. Uh, P.O. Box 12. And then letter to the media. Mail to Quinn Carter, Charleston Herald. Miss, the key lets you open my box with all the evidence you need. I sent it to you because the truth has got to come out you're Appalachia's most trusted news source and people will listen if you do an investigation Grafton Steel has been violating safety standards and getting people killed with a toxic sludge uh, they're dumping into the water they shouldn't get away with this just because they're doing military work for the war little kids are dying holy crap dude what? This is literally starting to sound like a conspiracy. Alrighty. You know, I'm not gonna lie to you, like, a lot of the times when I do missions, uh, I don't really read through all of the stuff. I just kind of go through the motions. Of course, I do get in whatever I can, but I don't go in-depth like I'm doing with this, uh, series. So I'm, I'm actually learning things as I'm going along here with you guys, too. That's crazy. Like, I didn't realize this was going to be, like, a conspiracy situation. Alright, so... Let's look at this box. Kid secure ID. Alright. Uh, keep safe. The serial number made for Freddie Wood status error. Oh, snap. Looks like we found the guy. Oh, we got some Mylurks too. What level are these guys? Oh, God. We got a diseased hunter. Die! Oh god. Well, at least I got him. You! Oh, at least they die with one hand or one hit. I don't want to carry too much food either. And I think I have the carnivore mutation. Yep. So I might just eat it like it is. I don't even care. Oh, yeah, hold on. Where am I going? Um. Clarksburg. Let's go ahead and fast travel to Clarksburg, even though it's just right here. I feel it'll be a little faster if I fast travel there. Albeit probably very, very slightly, but it's all good in the neighborhood. OMG. Hurry up, game. I should have just ran there. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Jobs or else now. Oh, uh, looks like we got some Pharrell ghouls over here. Why does that do that? Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh god, I hear more of them. You die. All right. We're literally right around the corner. 23 more paces. But we gotta be careful though because feral ghouls are... They can gang up on you pretty quickly. Ah! I mean, I guess I don't really have too much of a problem. Because my guy is pretty tanky, isn't he? I'm kind of curious. What do you... Uh, like, for those of you who actually play this game... Uh, what kind of build do you guys use on your characters? Okay, let's see. Notification. While every effort is made... Oh god, I hear them coming. 
while every effort is made to assure data is accurate, the post the post service does not certify any information contained uh, herein. The post the postal service is in no way responsible for any errors uh, that occur in these records, nor liable for action taken as a result of reliance on this information. Instructions: Select appropriate search type. Okay, so we got a PO box number, right? So PO box number 12. Oh, we got his address. Otis Pike 3 whatever in Grafton. He lives here in Grafton. All right. So we need to go. All right. So that's for the second mission. Let's go to Otis. You know what? Let's just run there. It's really not that far. But who knows? It probably would be faster to fast travel, but it's all too late. I'm already en route. Is there a Tinker's workbench at the Grafton station? I can't remember. Have I even discovered the Grafton station? I have not. I've discovered Grafton, but not the Grafton station. Luckily, we're here. So... Hope... Hopefully there is a Tinker's Workbench because we have to uh, use a Tinker's Workbench to fix the kid, kid Secure. It's optional, but I do want to do it. So, looks like we're going to be... Oh, Super Mutants. <sighs> Die! Grafton Day. Let's see. Let's see really quick. Let's see really quick what we can do with this Grafton monster. <laughs> Where is it? Wait, really quick, is there a Deeper's Workbench in here? Nope. Alright, let's kill this guy. <laughs> All right, these are, these are just stupid robots. All right. Give me your thing. All right, let's go see if we can actually kill the Grafton mon monster. I'm actually legitimately curious. I hope the super mutants don't kill him, though. There he is. Oh, God, he's level 30. What the hell? He's good at teleporting. Die, Mr. Monster of Grafton, Nader. Oh, well, we're not we're not having any problem. If we had if we had oh he's got a black powder rifle. If we had uh swing speed, dude, we would have absolutely demolished him. All right, let's see what we get out of it. Kind of curious. Ah. And nothing spectacular. Yay, there is one here. Hopefully we got the crafting materials now. Quest items. Kid secure. Yes, we do. Alright, in the event uh, uh, I am misbehaving, injured, or lost, please contact Miss Annie. Status removed by authorized adult entity? Dude, this guy definitely knew who he was. Alright, how far are we from the place? Alright, looks like we're actually right around the corner. Yeah, I can see the little marker. It's up, it's up here. This is starting to get really sad, man. He's a freaking child, man. Taken advantage by somebody he knew and potentially loved. Alright, it's downstairs, it looks like. How do I get in there? Alright, right here. What's this? Notice of termination. Mr. Pike. This letter serves as a formal confirmation of our informal discussion uh, today regarding the termination of your employment with Grafton Steel. It is unfortunate that you have been drawn into this ridiculous pop propaganda as a law-abiding government contractor. Grafton Steel abides by our commitments to meet or exceed standards for safety and production. You have demonstrated a complete disregard for Grafton Steel's reputation, its importance to the war effort, 
and repeated counsel intended to help you. Sincerely, Stacy Tibbetts, Human Resources Manager. So this is probably going to be a situation of ransom. Ooh, look, it's a bubble bear. All right, let's check this terminal. All right, calendar, calendar. Oh, okay, nothing in calendar. All right, it's probably dumb to write down, write this down, but I gotta get my thoughts uh, put down somewhere. So I guess this is my diary. February 26. Now Colton and Leland have passed on. The steel mill will keep pumping poison out. I'm not sure what to do. What can I do? I can't get other work with my back being so bad and Arthur is kin. May 7th. That cute Susie Jenkins died horribly with lumps growing inside her little body. I feel so bad for her folks. No one should have to bury that little child like that. I don't see that I have any choice. Arthur can't see past the dollar sign and doesn't give a crap about anything. People are dying. Oh crap. This is crazy. I finally did it. I secretly told the news about what's happening here. That's why he got fired. The safety rules are ignored and kids are dying. It's not right. No, I agree. It's not right at all. Who boy. Uh, I stirred up I stirred up the hornet's nest. There's a pro there's protesters and reporters and all kinds of people camping outside the steelworks now. They're blocking the trucks and such. They're real riled up. Of course they are, dude. That's insane. The soldiers came and closed those folks and cleared those folks out and posted guards with guns. Arthur was laughing about it today, talking about those commie whiners getting what's coming to them. I guess I gotta try something else to make things right. What? Got fired today and booted off the premises. And booted off the premises. Said they knew I was helping the protesters. Guess being kin didn't matter. That is insane. Arthur didn't even talk to me himself. I guess I have to find another way. Oh. Didn't mean to get out of the terminal. Nope. Get, oh my god, I did it again. Get back in there. Alright, let's see. Correspondence. Kid secure. Uh... Customer support, Otis Pike. Uh, I'm sorry to hear about the issues you've been experiencing with your son's kid secure. Only an authorized adult that's been added to the account can remove the bracelet. We keep your, we keep your kid secure. I've attached the override instructions as you requested. Please let us know if you have any further instructions. Man, that was... Stupid by the company, man. Damn safety inquiries. Uh, I'm happy to assure you that Grafton Dam is an amazing marvel of technological achievement. We have found that humans make too many mistakes, so other than a remote oversight capability, uh, the Grafton Dam is fully automated. Just like everything else in this in this world. I would be happy to arrange a tour for you if you are interested further. Sincerely, Quentin Geese. Okay, Community Outreach Manager. All right, Ken. Uh, no, just no. We aren't related. Uh, you and I. Molly was the love of my life, and while she lived, I had to deal with your crap. What were you thinking? Trying to screw me over with your with the protesters at the dam. You tried to take advantage of my memory of your sister. The hell with you. Freddy likes you. I can't prevent the kid secure from letting you locate him since Molly trusted uh, you as a guardian. Just go away, Otis. Well, hope. Crap. That's a whole lot to digest there, dude. 
All right, so let's go ahead and fast travel to the Pioneer Scouts, and then we'll just travel south to the Grafton Dam. Doesn't appear like we've actually located or uh, discovered the location yet, so should be pretty interesting, dude. This is seriously a big old like conspiracy type thing that we're going through right now, isn't it? All right, so now we gotta go south. Luckily, wait, can we go through here? Because that's the Grafton Dam over there. So, I got a plan. Because I think we could just go this way. Oh, there's something over here. Let's go ahead and kill some stuff. This is where you get the plans for the crossbow, too. You're not supposed to kill him. I wanted to kill him. See, right here. Crossbow. You can actually get a crossbow and a uh, crossbow ammo here, too. Wait a minute. Where am I going? All right. So I got to be careful, though, because I can get hurt down here. Run! Well, that was a weird splash, but okay. How many... Okay, yeah, let's... Dude, I have 62 radways. That's insane. Alright, looks like we're actually almost here. And look at that. Super mutants. Hello. I splatter your... No, you won't. Let's play. Sure, let's. Alright, there's somebody in this building. It might have been just that guy that we just found. I mean, you could retreat, but you're still gonna lose no matter what. I take, I take hits pretty well. Is that everybody? I guess so. All right, how can I get in there? Oh, you know what? I, I know. I know how to get there. Check this magic out. Is it this way? Ow. I want to say it's this way. Yep, there we go. Yay, I made it. There's definitely super mutants in here too. So I gotta be careful. Hey, stop shooting. What? <laughs> I don't know how the hell that happened, but it did. Die. Is that everybody? It is. We killed everybody in here already. Alright, so we gotta find clues, don't we? Alright, first clue right there. Uh, more secret stuff. Uncle, oh, this is from him. Oh, this is sad. Okay, more secret stuff. Uncle Otis got my candies and took them. He says my teeth is gonna rot out. Not, uh, I don't know what that says. Uncle Otis just go gross food out. Not, <laughs> uh, he is all mad now and stole being fun. I want to go home and play with my. Rifle, bam, bam, I just good shoot. I'm just, I'm a good shooter. I got a rat, but now it's dead and no fun. Uncle Otis sucks. I'm going to get him. I want to go home and he says no. I want candies and he says no. I want to fart <laughs> in the tub and he says no. I am going to make trails like pioneer scouts uh said to do in the woods and catch uncle otis because i'm the great test oh my god dude that's fucking heartbreaking little otis man i mean we all know it's gonna be it's not gonna be a very happy ending only because we know the situation in fallout 76 but still sad Freddy Adventure number three. Biggest secret. It worked. Uncle Otis got his foot in my trial and slipped 
I put the oil. He is so mad and yelling at me. He is stuck. Slide down now. Ha ha ha. I showed him. I'm gonna go home. Oh my god, he's going home. Alright. What is this one? Arthur Woods Lighter. And I'm not gonna play this. I'm just gonna take it because that's a video game. Alright, let me see what that was though. Junk, maybe? Arthur Woods Lighter. Alright, looks like just a random lighter. Oh, this is his toys. Freddy Adventure number one. Uh, Freddy Ot uh, Otis got me a grognak game. He's so cool. We got to let... To get inside the dam. Uh, Uncle Otis said he was getting us food. Uh, I... Something he gets... Oh, I hope he gets pizza. Pizza is cool. I got home candies from a desk. Haha, -ha, free candies. I climbed and hid them. They are all mine. Bobby is gonna be jealous. Uncle Otis lets me do stuff. We farted in tubs here and the stinky ones got a prize. I won. I'm the best. Freddy's the, gra the, the greatest. Oh my god, dude. That, oh, Diary of Otis Pike. Is this him? Uh, more of this diary. Still dumb to write it down. October 15, 2077. Checked out the water park where the kid will be in a couple of days. Almost got caught too, but dropped the Grafton Steel Mill protest. Left this uh, to throw off people. Uh, October 17, 2077, I knew the kid was a brat, but I had no idea. Maybe this wasn't a great plan. Uh, October 18th, uh, we hold up in the dam. I've got the place locked down tighter than a Mr. Cupboard. Mr. Cupboard? Okay, sure, why not? Uh, have not, not having much luck with a ransom. See, I knew it was a ransom situation. It's not like I wanted money. Just shut the plant down and get some safety people in the m in there to make it better. October 20th, the kid is having fun with our great adventure. Now all he does is whine and draw rude pictures. I'm not sure who's the captive here. Arthur left a note at the ransom site said I could keep his kid. Oh my god, wouldn't shut down the plant, would let his only son go to save the country from commies. Nice. October 21st, I swear the kid is plotting to kill me. He keeps bumping me uh, when I'm on my catwalk. He was playing with a bit of a rope saying he was practicing his Pioneer Scout knots, but I'm pretty sure he's making a news. Oh my god. I don't know what to say. That is an intense situation, dude. Alright, where's the next place? We have to go to the estate. Where's the estate? Okay, right there. Luckily, we found this place so we can fast travel there. Oh my god, bro. So, the kid legitimately killed his Uncle Otis. On top of that, Uncle Otis had kidnapped him to use as a makeshift ransom not for money but so that they can shut down the plant for good reason they were killing kids essentially intentionally or unintentionally i don't know who knows but my god bro that's insane but it sounds like the kid got away all right i think we gotta get in this thing wait hold on oh freddy's not a hasty note he did get away Daddy, I can't find you, and I'm scared. I hear lots of sirens, and man says I got to go with him to some secret place now. He said Daddy gave money so I can go to the vault and be sick. Oh, my God, dude. Thank God. Uncle Otis is at the dam. We had a fun time, except he was mean, so I left. Where are you? 
Oh my god, I'm so happy he's fine. Honestly. Personal. I'm both frightened and excited that we will soon be parents. Aw, sad. I'm so glad you've agreed to let Otis work with you at the mill. Now uh, he irritates you. <laughs> He's my only brother and I love him. I've done a silly thing and ordered a very expensive thing for the baby. I hope you don't mind. I love you. You're Molly. Camp Tomahawk. I wonder what that expensive thing is. Uh, thank you for giving us the chance to make your son, Freddy, a Pioneer Scout. Yay! We are thrilled that he will be attending camp with us this summer as we have healthy activities planned to enrich his experience. Please don't uh, hesitate to contact us if you have any concerns or questions. Scoutmaster James A. Johnson. Nanny Annie. <laughs> uh, thank you for your recent inquiry about the upgrades. Your Miss Nanny model. Oh, that's the expensive gift. I have dispatched a catalog to you in the post with our newest innovations. Please let us know if I can assist you any further. Respectfully, Jeff Perry, General Atomics International Sales Manager. Voltec Project Safe House. Oh my God. Uh, to answer your question, yes, there is a room for both you and your son. Yes, your war efforts are greatly appreciated. Yes, you can arrange for you and your son to be delivered to a safe location in the event of war since you will likely be separated from him. Wait, there, uh, to a safe location in the event you're of war since you will likely be separated for, from him. If he is at either location, you specified his home, his school, he will be, we will be able to assist. No, his nanny will not be able to join him. Best regards. Oh my god, at least there's a freaking safety date. Okay. I'm afraid uh, the worker uh, safety numbers in the past quarter have increased drastically uh, over the previous quarter. He, this might look pretty bad if released to the regulatory board. Even with our government preferred status, Grafton Steel would take a lot of heat. Maybe we can adjust the format of our report. This is another argument for automated workers though. Repair costs are a lot cheaper than lawsuits. What do you think, Stacy? Morale. Worker morale has been plummeting. I started asking around and I think Otis Pike is bad mouthing the company. With your permission, I will arrange for his activities to be watched more closely. That's how they found out that he was basically leaking information. Termination. I've terminated the problem employee and reported his commie leanings to the authorities as you requested. Under the Wartime Workers Act, uh, he could hang for treason. Holy shit, dude. If you want to press the issue, please advise. Stacy. Production. Mr. Wood, our numbers are dropping fast. I think the workers are intentionally damaging automated help. I'm not sure they're going to be the best solution in this tr uh, turbulent times. Can you investigate whether conscription is an option while we wait for the delivery of more automated workers? Regards, Stacy. Well, all right. Let's see. Estate controls, personal. There's a lot of reading. Molly. I'm both frightened and excited that we will... Wait, I, we already read this. Okay, yeah, it looks like we already read this. I mean, it looks like... It got a happy ending. Granted, he went to a vault -Tec vault, but it looks like the dude was very well connected with vault -Tec. So, hopefully, it's not one of those experimental vaults. And hopefully, to be honest, I hope he went to Vault 76. But, you never know. For all we know, he probably went to a bad vault. Like, like the Garys or something. I don't know. Oh, God. At least we know he survived that whole situation. But, now let's go report this information to Annie. His little 
Nanny. <laughs> Annie the Nanny. I love the name. It's clever. But, uh... Yeah, I'm sure she's gonna be... Happy at the fact that... He's... Potentially alive. Obviously, we don't know the situation inside the vault, but... Kinda seems like he is alive. Annie, I have to tell you something, girl. Come here. I don't know why you're in here, though. You! You are returned. And my Freddy? This writing. This is Freddy's. His father. He did not want Freddy with the uncle, but... So much love Freddy had for him. Oh, mon petit chou. So terrible for my brave boy. The tracker also. Oh, yes, you found it. Oh, the signal is strong now. I can pull data from the terrible day. This you found at the home? Oh, my poor child. Such fear. The writing says he went to safety before the bombs. This means he could live. Thank you. These things I have found, you must take as a reward. Yay! Let's see what we get as a quest reward. That 10 millimeter submachine gun is a legendary, a unique weapon too. But let's see what else we get. Stim pack, 308, plan 10 millimeter SMG, metal eggs. And there is our weapon. That is crazy, dude. But honestly, we're just closing in to an hour. And realistically, let me see. Hold on. Yeah, I don't think we're going to have enough time to do any of the other missions. So for that reason, we're definitely going to have to call it a video right here, right now. But this mission, honestly, I kind of skimmed through it uh, the first time I did it. But this time, I actually obviously went through the entire thing and I realized that it's actually a freaking heartbreaking story, dude, with a, with a, a potential happy ending. Obviously, we don't know the whole situation with Freddy and what happened to him post this little scavenger hunt. But, I mean, for just, just the fact that he made it to a vault makes me happy. And, but... Who knows what happened at the vault, man. You know you can't trust vault Tech either. So, who knows? It's a poten uh, That's why I'm saying it's a potential happy ending. But, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, do me a huge favor. Smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel as well if you're not already subscribed. Because it really does help this channel grow. So, with that being said, catch you guys in the next video. Deuces.